All right, next step. We've got a whole bunch of stuff over here. Not as much as we had with our Moxie website, but still some stuff that we need to organize. And over time, we're gonna have more things. So we're just gonna jump the gun and start making some folders. So just like Moxie, you need to right click over here on the side. If you right click down here, sometimes it will and sometimes it won't give you these options. So it's always just a safe bet to right click on this left hand side. And new folder is going to be your option. And we are going to name this one images. And then go ahead and make a couple more. Oop, that clicked away from me. Images, HTML pages. And last but not least, resources. Now check this out. When I made this resources folder, do you see how it got kind of tabbed over? It got stuck in images. If that ever happens, just grab a hold of that folder and just pull it straight up and it will kick out of there. Now you also notice I already have a folder in here called JJ Banner Materials. We'll leave that alone for now. If you need to see, it's a little line right here. Just grab that till the arrow pops up and you can slide your stuff sideways so you can actually read what it is that you're working with. So what we need to do is JJ Banner Materials is going to be the first thing we move because we don't want to confuse it with these other folders. Take JJ Banner Materials and drop it into Resources. And you're always going to update. The next thing that's going to go in resources is both of these Photoshop files. So you have JJ Banner and you have Dino Feet. We're going to take both of those and drop it into resources. Those Photoshop files are just there if we screw something up. So we got them on the back burner in resources. Last thing we're going to put in resources is this Word document called JJ Home Text. We're going to use that here in a couple more videos to add some text and you don't have to type it all by hand. You're welcome. So in resources, you should have JJ Banner materials, Dino Feet, JJ Banner, and JJ Home Text. Just look real quick and make sure that JJ Banner is a Photoshop file. Close that folder up. Next thing you can do is you can take all of these pictures, MapQuest, JJ Home, Dino Park Map, and Dino Feet, and you can drop those into images. Looks a lot cleaner now, doesn't it? Let's make a brand new HTML file, and then we'll be ready to go with our next video. So right click, and then this time instead of a new folder, you're going to do a new file. Now, take a quick peek here on your new file. Remember type in .html when we coded? You still have to keep that. So if that doesn't appear, you better be sure and type it. If it shows up for you, hooray, you don't have to worry about it, but you better not delete it. We're going to call this page home. And when you're done with it, you're going to drag it and drop it into HTML pages. And of course, update. 